Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So yes, we're gonna go ahead and do part two of the add-ons for the BoxyCharm that I was telling you about. So I do have a few items here for the add-on. Um, so we'll just go ahead and get into it. I'm gonna go ahead and prime my lids and get everything ready. Um, I am gonna be working with the Violet Boss palette. That's what I purchased as an add-on. And this is just a nice little shimmery purple palette that we're gonna use today. So I'm going to go ahead and prime my lids here. And we're going to use that same eyeshadow primer, being that we're doing the add-on for BoxyCharm. So I'm just going to use that same eyeshadow primer, which is the Farah's eyeshadow primer. And we're just going to go ahead and blend this in. Right. And then I'm going to go ahead and add on some transition colors on the lids because I didn't see any transition any transition colors in the palette. So I'm just going to use this um, Zoeva palette real quick just to put a couple transitions in there. All right, so now that the transition colors are on, we're gonna go ahead and get into the palette. Just get right on in there. Again, it's the Violet Voss. It's a cute little palette here. Um, so being that I have like pink and purple on, we'll use a couple of these colors. I'm just gonna roll with it and see what we can create. Um, so first off, I think I'll probably do like a little light purple, then maybe build it up with a little pink and maybe some shimmer. So we'll see, we'll go with it and see what happens. I'm just gonna dip into this light purple here. Start off there. I'm just gonna put this all over the lid here. And I haven't prepped my look or anything like that. I'm just taking this palette and just going with it here. All right, so I'm gonna do the next side. All right, so, so far so good. I like the color of that. And then I think I'm gonna build it up a little bit. I think I'm gonna put a little bit of darker purple on here. So I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna use the same brush, use this darker purple and put it at the edge of my eye here. It's nice and pigmented. So I do like that. Very pretty color. And I think I'm going to take that pink. I'm gonna take a pink here, which is this color right here. I'm just gonna take that and put this like in the front of my eye here. I like this palette. This palette's very pretty, very pigmented. I love the colors. Now I'm gonna try that wing liner again too, that little uh, gel liquid liner that I was using from the BoxyCharm, I'm gonna do that as well. I'm gonna use that on my eyelid, or my eyes today. Mm -hmm. 
And I will have to blend out the edges. I see that, but I really like the color. It's very pretty. I may even add on some blue. They got like this dark blue right here, like a bluish purple. I may add that on there too. I think I'm gonna do that. Just put that on the edge of my eye here. See what it does here. Oh yeah, that's pretty. Okay, that's a pretty color, guys. I like that. All right, so I'm gonna blend this out a little bit because it's looking a little bit crazy and splotchy a little bit, but I'm gonna blend it out. So there's that. That looks a lot better. I like that. It's really pretty. Okay, so that's blended in. And then I'm thinking about taking like this light shimmer. Um, this little, it's like a pinkish purple. I don't know if you can see it really, you know, that well here. But I'm going to maybe mix these two shimmers. I'm going to spray my brush. I probably don't even have to spray my brush, but I'm going to do it anyway. And see what we can do here. I'm just going to mix all three of them. Why not? So that looks pretty, guys. Can you see that? All right, so I'm just going to spray my brush again, and mix the shades again, and do the next side. And I'm debating. I don't know if I'm going to do um, eyeliner or not because I'm going to put on lashes today. So we'll see. I don't want it to take away from the look, but we'll see. We'll see what happens, what I decide to do. So that is on and then we'll go ahead and do some eyeliner and then I'll put on the lashes and see what happens there. So let's go ahead and do this eyeliner. I'm going to use my e.l.f. tapes again. Um, so here they are again. These are the e.l.f. tapes. They're really nice. So this time I'm not doing the wing, I'm not doing the stamp because I messed that up last time, but we're gonna go ahead and see what happens with these um, eyeliner here. So that is the eyeliner and 
I probably have one side better than the other. You know, that's how it goes. You always get one side better than the other. This is the eyeliner. I'm just gonna go ahead and take these uh, tapes off and see how we did. Okay, so the lashes are on, I like them. And give me just a moment, we're gonna go ahead and do the foundation. Again, I told you that I do have the Kat Von D um, Locket foundation. My shade is Tan Deep 190, and it's a powder foundation. We're gonna go ahead and put it on. I did go ahead and prep my skin. I went ahead and put on the primer and everything. So I'm just gonna go ahead and dip into this. I'm looking for full coverage because I have a little bit of acne, a little bit of scarring, acne scarring, but it's all good. So I'm just gonna go ahead and dip into this with my little brush here and see what it does. I think it's a pretty good shade. It's a little dark, a little bit, but it's okay. It's all right. Well, actually looking at it on camera, it does look a little bit dark, but I mean, nothing major or anything like that. So we'll go ahead and put this on. I use a sponge. I'm gonna go in with a brush here in a minute though, like to get around the edges and stuff. And blend it in a little bit more. Okay, so I'm just gonna take me a little more dense kind of brush. Just like a little dense kind of brush and just take it, put it on. I would say this is like medium to full coverage. I'm sure you can build it up a lot if you wanted to. But not too bad. That's not too bad. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead in with the concealer. I wonder how that's gonna work, the concealer. Um, so again, I have the Dose of Colors concealer. I have two shades, one is dark, that's in 21, and then I have another one that's in dark and it's in 24. I'm gonna use more of the um, 24 first and then going with a lighter, lighter shade on top. And now that that's set in a little bit, I'm just gonna blend it up with a sponge. I've been using my concealer brushes, but I've noticed that I'm having a little bit more creasing. So I'm going to just experiment today with my sponge and see if I get more coverage as far as my creasing goes, you know, under the eyes. So. All right, so now we're gonna do the bronzer, blush, and highlight. Um, I didn't purchase any bronzer from that line from BoxyCharm, um, so I'm just gonna go in with my Cab Cosmetics, and I'm gonna use this bronzer today. And I'm just gonna use a few of these dark shades over here. I know the palette's big, but I'm just gonna use like a few of these. I just go down the bottom row here and use those shades. Just mix them all. All right, and I'm still loving the Milani blush. So I'm gonna go in with this uh, baked blush here. And this one is in the shade Bella Bellini. It's a real pretty pink. And 
And then I am gonna go ahead and use that little highlighter that I did use out of the BoxyCharm that I did, per well, that I did get in the BoxyCharm. Again, this one is the YC Collection. And this was in the shade Creamsicle, Creamsicle Highlighter. I like this. I noticed that it blended out perfectly on a certain side. So we'll just go ahead with this one right here. Just dab it. And I'm just gonna take that uh, same beauty blender and just use it, so it's no big deal. As you can tell, it's really pretty. Do this on the next side. I notice it's kind of sticking to this one because it's like a powder foundation that I have underneath, so it makes it kind of difficult to blend it, but it's okay. You can still see the color. So it's really pretty right there. And then let's see here, we're gonna go in with a lipstick. I'm probably gonna use the Milani lipstick being that I have pink on, so. Um, and this one is in the shade Teddy Bear. So this is real pretty too. All right, so that is on. I gotta do my lower lashes, my mascara for my lower lashes. And we will be all set. Now, this didn't come in the boxy charm, of course. This is my um, Essence Lash Princess. So we'll go ahead and do that. But yeah, this is the completed look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Stick around and I will see you soon. Until then, stay blessed.